Just headed to the racetrack. It's Austin's first time driving a trailer. It's a little bit frightening. Is it? Is it frightening? Well, I just had to go through a roundabout, so yeah. <laughs> With cliffs. Yeah, cliff. That's a cliff. God, that's a very cliff. large cliff. It's several hundred feet of a cliff. And yeah, check out the view, guys. Isn't that awesome? View on the way to the racetrack. So we are headed to Yellowstone Drag Strip. Obviously, Austin's driving. We got Daytona in the back seat. Woo! Obviously, West with Auto Mafia is here, so Auto Mafia Racing Team headed to the track. Yeah! Three miles to the drag strip. It's a long, bumpy road. Are you ready? Yeah, are you ready? Uh, I don't know, I guess. Were you born ready? No. No, absolutely. Is the car ready? I hope so. Actually, I gotta put the shifter back on. <laughs> the other might be necessary. I hope I brought the right tools. <laughs> whatever. Yeah, whatever. Screw the, screw the ball down hard, it'll be fine. You can, you can just have a man hand. Yeah. That'll be fine. Roll out. 
Last call for lanes four and five. Super Pro, first call, lane six and seven. Next up we got Austin Brindley in the Mustang. Over here in the left lane, Mike Vance in the Mustang in the Car Mark 360 lane. cap is really loose like you can twist it on but then it just kind of wiggles about and so it'll just kind of wiggle itself off and fall off and that happened so we're gonna fix it with a trash bag and zip ties fixing it with a trash bag and zip ties I don't I, I want to race race track fix them <laughs> I paid too much money here to not race too much money to not race man That'll work. Alright, now we gotta trim it so the header doesn't melt it. There's lots of hot bits in here, so. I think it's good. Right, I'm gonna trim it a little bit. Up on the 1285 dial in. Next up, we got Ralph Michael from the Comet. It's Austin Brindley. Austin Brindley and the Mustang, sponsored by Auto Mafia Racing. Austin's gonna take off way sooner. This other guy's dialed in like a 12.52. So he should be about mid-track by the time the guy takes off. Alright guys, 
All right, guys. So we broke out, ran a 14.97, fastest Austin's ever gone. So we're gonna rejet the carb here, and we'll see if we can make it go a little bit faster. All right, new jets. Let's see how it does. And he broke the beams. Good thing this is a small track. Fourteen nine seven two. All right, that's probably our last run. Let's see what he does, guys. All right, Austin, so really your second time ever drag racing, right? Yeah. Yeah, I thought it went pretty well, man. Uh, what'd you think? How'd the car run? I think it ran a lot better this time, so I'm pretty happy. Heck broke yeah. 14. Broke 14, or broke for 15. 15. So we ran a 14.97 and 95 miles an hour. Not half bad for Project Jack-O-Lantern, considering we have what, two grand in it? Something like that. Something like that. So, uh, heck yeah. Look, guys, look forward to more builds. We only have a 308 gear in this thing, so that's definitely hurting us because of the auto. Probably going to put in a 410, and we'll see what she does then. Hopefully, she'll be a mid 14, if not a high 13. Um, I know some of you guys are going to be like, oh, you can't just increase the gears and go a second faster. Well, uh, we'll see what we can do. You know, maybe we'll do something else to add a little more power. Maybe go down another jet or jet the secondaries down as well and uh, see what that does for us. So for now, take it easy.